And when was last time you cheated up on tour? Um, British Open. British, okay. Yeah. So it's been a break for you. Yes. Did you play any Symmetra at all? Or I did not, just no. Time off. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Ready? All right, now we're here with Paul Arito, who had a great round of 69 today. Uh, three birdies over your last four holes, yeah. and Haley was just telling us about an amazing chip you made uh, earlier in the round. Tell us about your round today. Actually, I had two chip-ins, which was nice, you know, keeps the momentum going. But I felt like I was patient. I just um, kind of made sure to give myself opportunities on the greens, especially if, even if it was 30, 40 footers, the greens are pretty tough. And just, you know, two putt and wait for that putt to drop. So it was good. I just kind of stayed in, in the moment and uh, I really enjoyed it. What a good golf course. The views are pretty. So that was pretty much it. Tell us about those two chip-ins, if you don't mind. Oh, yeah. So um, it was a part three. I think it was like the third hole, fourth hole. Um, and just hit it kind of a little to the left and I said okay I'm just gonna hit a chip up there I had a good line and it went in kind of like the last few rolls it mm -hmm. dropped in and then here one of the last few holes 15 I think just before the par 3 um, no excuse me 16 yeah because 17 is the par 3 and hit it a little bit to the left not the greatest swing I told myself it's fine just you know get the ball rolling hit a good chip with my 56 and it just kind of trickle 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 and like the last drop again I was like okay <laughs> So that was fun. <laughs> Good. You come in here with fresh legs, last teed it up yeah. at uh, AIG Women's Open. Yep. Uh, how how did you spend that, that downtime? Did you put the clubs away at all, or how did yeah. you get ready for this week? You know, I took a couple days off, but um, I had to sort of sort out my ear. I have a situation that I need to figure out, so did that. So a couple appointments. Saw my coach up in um, Chicago area. Um, so, yeah, a little bit of everything, but uh, made sure to rest up as well and, you know, get ready for this next four stretch tournaments. Mm -hmm. Yeah, It's going to be a busy stretch it's and we're starting off with a, a beast of a walk. Yes. How are you managing coming and learning a new golf course yeah. and a golf course that's so physically taxing? Exactly. And I said, okay, the next four days is leg day, <laughs> so I don't have to go to the gym. But, um, yeah, you just have to pace yourself. I'm trying to drink a lot, eat a lot, make sure I hydrate, you know, off the golf course so that I can be ready for the next day. This morning I felt pretty fresh. Definitely in the practice rounds I could feel a little bit tired more. But, um, yeah, just good rest, a little practice after this, and rest well for tomorrow so I think is key. Awesome. Great so much. Yeah. See you. Well, great so much. That was smart. Great. <laughs> good job. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Thank you. <laughs>